If you guys want to win more games, get innovative plays and updated game metas, then visit trythisplay.com and use code NOBLE at checkout for 10% off your purchases. Link is in the description. He is Cooper. Off to the races for the touchdown. What's up today my fellow mass soldiers? So what we're gonna be doing right now is another Dallas Cowboy theme team gameplay. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. All right, so I already did a few, quite a few gameplays for you guys, right? Switch it up a little bit. So with this one, we're gonna go ahead and just, you know, put Romo back in and uh, continue, to, continue to go out there and hopefully win some more games, you know? Um, we've been actually doing pretty well. This Romo card, I'm gonna tell you right now, man, for his stats for being a, he's actually 85 uh, overall, but with Blue Kims, he's at 86, as you can see right here. But this card alone is insane. Like, his stats are already, like, pretty decent for his overall. So when he gets his new legend, whenever he gets his legend, um, I can't wait because I already know his card's gonna be, like, insane. So anyways, he comes in at 6'2", 73 speed, 88 throw power, 88 throw accuracy short, 82 throw accuracy mid, 82, 87 throw accuracy deep, 83 throw under pressure, 84 throw under run, and 80 play action. So, like I said, he's actually been out there making a lot of plays happen. Not very much has he overthrown it. He overthrowed it maybe a few times, but majority of times he gets that ball off and gets it all fast. So I'm happy with that. This is our O-line that's actually going to be protecting him out there. Um, Leo Collins, Zach Martin, Travis Frederick, Larry Allen, Tyron Smith, right, which is goons. Um, I'm happy to have them. We got uh, Blake Jarwin, Jason Wynn as our tight ends. Even though Jason Wynn does not get Cowboy cams, he's still on the squad. And, he, of course, he'll always be a Cowboy. He played for the Cowboy for the longest, right? Um, hopefully, they give him a power up. I don't know why they don't give him a power up. They gave it to him last year. Hopefully, they give him another one this year so we can fully power him up. Um, this Michael Gallup right here, even though he's a low overall, he actually, he actually balls his brains out out there. Like he goes out there and makes it happen. So I can't wait for him to get upgrades. Um, all the way, um, he, uh, he really don't do much, but he's just there because he's a fullback. Um, Ezekiel Alley is a goon. You guys already know that. And Tony Pollard. I like this Tony Pollard. I can't wait for him to get another upgrade. Um, he has a high, high, high. He's. He always has a high chance to fumble it, right? Because he's not a high overall and his carry ain't that great. However, you feed him here and there, he does. He gets the job done. Like I said, the higher the overall, it's a little bit better. He gets better carry stats. Um, so I hope they give him a, a better card later on. But right now, he's fast. Like, he actually gets it done. Um, I did quite a few game plays, and you guys actually seen him out there ball. So I don't feed him that much, like I said, because he's a, he's a fumble risk. So... But I do feed him here and there. We got C.D. Lamb, which is going out there. Mark Cooper. Oh, man, he's always making it happen. And you guys see one of the gameplays one time where Cole Bleasy ended up going in there um, because the receiver was the stamina ran out one of the receivers. And he actually scored a touchdown the first time that he actually played on the squad. But anyways, here's our defense. We got Jalen Smith, Robert Quinn, Xavier Woods, Anthony Hidgen, Langdon Vanderus, Ha, Clinton Dix, uh, Jabozio Wuzier, Demarcus Lawrence, Okoye, Glover. Everson Griffin, Jordan Lewis, Byron Jones, right? And we also got Anthony Brown as one of our back backups, which I actually supplement him in because he got like 89 speed on our squad. But anyways, there it is there. This is our squad. This is the team. We're going to go ahead and get this gameplay started. Drop a like on the video and enjoy this gameplay. All right, that's us. All right, so this this guy got a squad on him, so. Let's see what we could do with this. All right, so we get the ball first, so we gotta make a, a good first start impression. You got me right there. Oh. Oh, 
Oh, let's go. Can we get it in? Can we get it in? Can we get it in? Oh, we're almost there. All right. Oh, so he, he gonna quit. It's all good. We'll go to the next game. All right, right after this. GG. All right, so this is our opponent. Okay, so. Shouldn't be too complicated, but you can't underestimate them, right? But, hey, we're going to have some fun right now. We're going to have some fun. We're blitzing them, though. We're, we're, we're not trying to give him any time. And coming with that blitz, is he's going to get dots at times unless we could stop him. We got to really... There we go. See? Yeah, we're just going to blitz him. I see, he got that. See, come on, Vanderish. That that's what I'm that's what I'm talking about, Vanderish. You seen that? He just made up for what happened right now. He's like, don't even trip, man. I just needed a longer um, pick six. Hey, bro, you made it. No losing, no stamina, no nothing. There you go. And we're going to go for two. Dot. Oh, we almost, we almost intercepted that. What he was trying to do right there. That's us. That's us. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, we got it. Okay. And we're going for two again. So what's going on right here? I don't want you guys to have to see all this, but this is his third time already. Uh, um, just letting the time run down. Just he's, he's just upset right now. So they're probably going to get him for excessive griefing or whatever the case may be. So... It should be. This was the last one, so it should be able to quit out. It is what it is. We'll just take. We'll just take our GG and be out with it. All right, we out.